back here on yes I don't know what we're doing on fan will fan will join us sometime I guess before the end of the day we're here at Yankee Stadium at uh, 406 not exactly the way you want to come on the air folks but I apologize for that we're having some technical problems somewhere along the line not with yes with FAN but here we are on yes at least right now as you see Yankee Stadium if you're watching on yes right now it is a gorgeous day here as Victor takes a shot of this beautiful stadium which will be rocking tonight baseball returns to the Bronx as the Yankees try to finish off the Minnesota Twins and yes it is officially folks baseball October here in New York City and listen they dialed up the right day for it a beautiful 70 degree sunny day it'd be nice to start the game in a couple of minutes but we will a few hours from now we'll take you right up until 7 30 and the pregame on yes we got a lot to do in just a couple of minutes you'll hear from Joe Girardi who has penned the same lineup he penned in game number one for a left-hander tonight Dunsing uh, will be with us will be on the mound tonight against uh, Phil Hughes so uh, of course Joe Girardi went to the same lineup that he went to in game one and why not it worked why change the lineup so that means no currents the Yankees are better than the Twins they're much better than the Twins and they own the Twins lock stock and barrel they have for a long time they've now beaten the twins eight straight times the twins are just they just know no matter how the game starts they always know how it finishes it finishes most times with mariano rivera on the mound shutting down shutting down the twins i hear music in my ear guys if, if it can get out i'd appreciate it okay um you know that it's been that way time and time again. It's been that way year in and year out. Now you're cutting my mic out. Uh, so if you wouldn't do that, I'd appreciate it. It would help a lot. Um, so year in, year out, that is the case. So for the Yankees, just continue to do what you do. If you're the Twins, just try and take the pressure off yourselves a little bit and see if you can maybe get yourself a win and start it back in the right direction. Let's see if we can regroup here. We'll take a break on yes and see if we can get this all straightened out and see if we can get everybody together on one page and then we can really uh, zero in on this broadcast back after this. <laughs> Back on, I think, FAN, although I have no idea. I haven't heard from FAN since I got to sat down in the seat, so I have no idea we're on FAN or not. So uh, we're going to be going to Joe Girardi in a minute. And uh, as soon as we do that, yes, we'll be rejoining us in a second here. I gather we're on FAN, although I have no notice of that because I have no, I cannot hear from the control room back at the studio. So uh, they tell me we might be on FAN right now. I have no idea. But we are on yes, I know that. So if we're on FAN too, that's just great. Uh, we're waiting on Joe Girardi who will join us here in a minute. We'll be with you until 7.30, 6.50 on the fan. Uh, the fan can leave now for all I care, but um, uh, we will get to Joe Girardi in a minute and we will uh, try to see if we can put a show together here in a second. Uh, they're having some technical difficulties if you haven't figured that out yet back at FAN. So we're waiting for Joe Girardi who will be with us. Same lineup tonight for the Yankees as obviously they try to wrap things up. Hughes gets his first start. Remember last year he went in the bullpen and obviously he did finish the season well this year. He did not pitch great the second half of the season. He got more run support than anybody could ever hope to get. That's why his record has been this good. He hasn't pitched great the second half of the season, but I thought you saw him in his last three or four starts to start to get much better and get much more effective with what he was doing. So I wouldn't be surprised to see Hughes do a good job. Now, Minnesota is a much, much better team against right-handed pitching. A much better team against right-handed pitching. Take that into account tonight. And Phil has allowed a lot of home runs. Relax, guys. I'll get to him. Relax. Jeez. You guys all got to calm down now. All right, let's get back to work. Just calm down, okay? Much better, much better team against right-handed pitching. Joe Girardi has just gotten to the podium. Let's listen. About that? Well, there was a big question mark about who was going to replace Matsu in our lineup hitting See, in the fifth hit slot. Right and, um, we talked about different guys that could possibly do it. In your lineup. Can you talk a little bit about that? Well, there was a big question mark about who was going to replace Matsu in our lineup hitting in the fifth slot. And um, we talked about different guys that could possibly do it. Anyone else? That's it? Okay. Thanks, Joe. Thank you. What? Who's talking now? Yeah. 
What do you need? Uh, all right, we're here now. I'm watching Girardi still talk, so now they're telling me Girardi's done, but, I mean, I'm watching him still speak. So now we're back here. Uh, we need to turn the TV down. We're trying to see if we can – let me just take a break, and now maybe we can sync up. I hear that fan's back with us now in full. I apologize for the start of the show. We'll be back after this. <laughs> the start of the show but we had a lot of technical difficulties and I just wanted to wish uh, some uh, friends of the family well because I was supposed to be at a wedding today uh, with my wife and uh, friends of my wife who were getting married uh, Sloan Schechter and Justin Meltzer and they were nice enough to understand that I needed to be here today and doing this uh, about 15 minutes ago they probably didn't figure that out figure out why I needed to be here but uh, obviously they were nice enough to understand that I was going to be here with the Yankees and here doing this today rather than be at their wedding so I wanted to wish them a very very well on the air and say uh, many happy returns and say good wishes and everything else uh, to Sloan Schechter and Justin Meltzer who are getting married on the island about six o'clock this evening. So we send them uh, our best and uh, thank you for understanding. Okay, I can hear everything coming back reverb in my helmet, uh, my headset. If you can help that, thank you very much. Uh, we've had some, a rough day so far, Ronnie, with the technical <laughs> stuff. We welcome in Ron Darling. Good to see you, Ronnie. I don't so know why you're bringing me in. I'm yes. not going to be able to help you. Yeah. I'll tell you <laughs> I, I need help today. We've had a lot of stuff going on. But, um, you know, it's interesting. I was saying to you that uh, it's still there, guys. I was saying to you that the fans the last couple of days have been crazy. <laughs> Guys, gotta put my mic on, please. Thanks. The